So, what is a vision board? It is a collage of images representing one's desires and dreams designed to serve as a source of inspiration and motivation. Those images can help us visualize the manifested physical or mental characteristics of our desires. And it can be a great motive to get into the creative flow and make a beautiful piece of collage. Why you should create vision boards? By showing our minds how our desires would look manifested, we train it to focus on the goal we have set and certain feeling that it consists of. It can also make it easier for us to discern things we truly want to achieve from the ones faking their way to our desires. Just like any form of creation, be it writing, drawing, it can help our subconscious make its way through and show us something new about ourselves, if not the most crucial part. However, creating vision boards doesn't have to represent something that deep to us, even though everything can touch us deeply in my opinion. But just a way of having fun and being creative, maybe also figuring out what our aesthetic would be and what are the colors and themes we resonate with most. Or it can just help us feel satisfied and relaxed by creating and looking at a lot of things we like at once. There are just so many ways to create your vision board digitally. By using any photo editing software, you will be able to make a collage of images. But one of my favorite ways to do it is on the iPad and my digital bullet journal using the GoodNotes app. My whole channel is dedicated to digital journaling and bullet journaling on the iPad. That is something that reminds me of physical use the most, just with so many more benefits and possibilities that make me truly inspired to create. So how to create your vision board in GoodNotes? Again, you can definitely do it on the blank piece of paper template inside of the app if you don't like using any pre-made journals. I like creating my vision boards in my pre-made digital bullet journal on the paper template inside of it. And also I have a separate section dedicated just for vision boards and mood boards, so I will be showing you these two ways today. But before we open our bullet journal, we should decide where we are going to import the photos from. Most of the times I would use Pinterest and just drag and drop the photos from there using the split screen on my iPad. Just make sure to open Pinterest in the Safari or other web browser because if you drag and drop from the app it won't work. I also like to store my inspiration on Instagram by saving the photos to different collections. And there are times when I stumble upon a photo I really like and I just download it to my phone, to my album, just for the vision board, mood board photos. I send those photos to my iPad and insert them into my digital bullet journal. These are just some of the ways to do it, I will be sharing my whole process in the next part of the video and I suggest you try it yourself and see what feels like the most comfortable, inspiring and easy way to do it for you. Mm -hmm. 